most expensive golf clubs in the world. Golfing is an expensive sport to play, but is also known for ways to network in the business world. That is why a lot of CEO and wealthy people fly all over the world to play it. They might not be professional like Tiger Woods, but they got deeper pockets than Tiger. If Jeff Bezos was playing with Bill Gates, they probably wouldn't be using your average golf clubs to tee off. Let's see what choices they would pick from the most expensive golf clubs in the world. Number 11. Hanley Golf's 5-Star $5,400 Now this is the cheapest on our list, but Hanley is one of the most renowned makers of golf clubs. These clubs are handcrafted using 24K gold and platinum. Just one club will set you back $5,400, and the whole set will cost you $75,000. But wait if you order now you still have to wait two months to get yours. You can get a Tesla or Mercedes-Benz with that kind of money, but the Honda got different tiers too. The two, three, four-star clubs are a little cheaper but still in the thousands range. Number 10. Adams Golf Tight Lies Spin Control $8,500 This Texas-based golf club manufacturer specializes in creating customized golf clubs for specific players. Hank Haney, the coach of Tiger Woods, was involved with the company. Many buyers flock to the brand because of this. Number 9. Gym Spot on 5 Dex Lux Diamond $10,000 now when you have diamonds, of course the price tag won't be cheap. Based in Santa Barbara, California, the Gemspot Jeweled Putters Company gives their clubs the bling by adding elegant gemstones to an already high quality and high performance golf club. Maybe you can use the diamonds to reflect the sun's rays into other players' eyes. Number 8. Tightless Scotty Cameron Tiger Woods Stainless Masters Winner $20,000 This is a limited edition produced by Tightless Scotty Cameron. They only made 20 21 units molded from brass or copper. Tiger Woods used this on his victory in his historic win in 1997. I'm sure the price probably is a lot more now since there are only 21 of these in the world. I guess if you have the same equipment, it does make you closer to playing like Tiger Woods. Number 7. Hammer Patton Fork Shaft Wood $49,000 This club was created by Spalding the company mostly known for basketballs now, but the company used to make a wide variety of sport products decades ago. The head of the club, the Spalding was sold at an auction in 2007 for $49,000. It was a part of the Jeffrey B. Ellis collection. He is a big collector of antique golf and even wrote a book on golf clubs. Number 6. Long Nose Scraped Golf Club $91,000 We are close to the six-figure mark and halfway through the list. Now this club was dated to the 18th century but it is kept in very good condition. This club was also sold in 2007 auction for a huge $91,000 price tag. Number 5. Golden Putter First Lady Special Edition $150,000 We are at the six-figure mark. This unique club named the Golden Putter First Lady Special Edition was created by German company Barth and sons, crafted out of cherry wood, with a very thin coating of 24 karat gold on the shaft, and diamonds encrusted on it plus a leather grip, and head with crystal decorations. This breathtaking golf club comes with an outrageous price, $150,000. Do you think a six-figure club will improve your game? Comment down below love to hear your thoughts. Number 4. Square Toe Light Iron Golf Club $151,000 It costs just a little more than the previous, but no one will probably be using this antique club to play. This club dates back to the 16th centuries. It is unbelievable that this club is made of light iron and didn't rust away after 400 years. It was also auctioned at the 2007 Sotheby's. The buyer probably bought it for its historical importance and probably the only club 
that dates back to the 16th centuries. Number 3. Scotty Cameron Newport 2 GSS Putter $155,000 This is a personal backup for Tiger Woods, was produced by Scotty Cameron. It's arguably the closest anyone will ever get to possessing the putter that won 14 majors. This backup version of Woods Putter from 2001 season the same year he completed the Tiger Slam at the Masters. Signed by Cameron verifies the putter was made as a backup for Tiger. Considering there might only be seven backup versions of Woods' famed Newport 2 GSS in existence, it's easy to see this one crossing into the six-figure range without breaking a sweat. It will probably be worth seven figures in the future. Number 2. Simon Kossar Fruitwood Metal Headed Blade Putter $165,000 Simon Kossar is one of the first golf club manufacturers to ever sign his name on the products he created. One of his legendary pieces of work dates back to the 18th century. The club features a metal-headed blade putter and a shaft crafted from rare fruit wood plus a complimentary fastened hosel. The antique golf club was sold at auction for no less than $165,000. Number 1. Andrew Dixon Long-Nosed Putter $181,000 Number 1 on our list is the oldest verified golf club. It has the stamp of Andrew Dixon and it's called the Long-Nosed Putter. The shaft is made of ash. The club was dated back to the 17th centuries and since its authenticity could be verified, it made it the most valuable golf club in the world. It was sold at auction for the tremendous sum of $181,000. Whoever bought it must have some deep pockets and loved golf. He probably won't be using it on the country club greens, but to show off to his friends. Now Jeff or Bill both have houses that actually have their own golf courses on them, so they probably tee off here and they're using the clubs on the list. Some sources said Bill Gates is currently hiding out at the Vintage Club in Indian Wells. California after the divorce with Melinda. The club is one of the most prestigious and ultra-exclusive private country clubs for billionaires. The club initiation fee is $300,000, then annual membership fee of $32,000. To live there it costs $1 million a year, but the billionaires usually leave their doors unlocked because the security is overseen by the former head of the White House Secret Services. Trying to sneak in there would be like trying to sneak into the White House. I guess playing golf can get you through the hard times as long as you have the money, that is. But Tiger Woods with a wooden stick can probably still beat the richest players. Since we are talking about Tiger Woods, he actually uses a full bag of tailor-made clubs, with the exception of his famous Scotty Cameron Newport 2 GSS putter. A set of tailor-made clubs will still set you back ten of thousands. Good clubs can help with your game, but even with the most expensive clubs, it probably won't get you a green jacket. It all comes down to practice and practice to raise your skills. But for the wealthy top 1%, the prices on these clubs are like pocket change to them, so it won't hurt to get them. Now, if you reach here, make sure to hit that subscribe leave a like, and comment down below which of these clubs you think Jeff and Bill they used to play. Make sure you check out our other videos on how the rich spend their money.